You know, it comes a time where when I go to church, I just want, you know, I just want everybody to be, you know, in a place where they feel like they can be open and they can be honest. And a lot of times I feel like that starts with, you know, who's ever in charge that starts with the leader. And this pastor at this church was like, I got time for it today because I've been here for too long and I ain't putting up with it no more. I got to tell you exactly how it is. Stand. All right, quiet. Look, whoa, 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 whoa now. I want y'all to stop this. See, sometimes I have to see these things, but y'all still, I want somebody to lead this song that's a good singer. And I don't want one person to keep jumping up every time something is sing. They'd be the first one to jump up to sing a song. Y'all make me say these things sometimes. Because you, you do it too often. When you do it too often, you're going to hear from me. And then guess what? I don't care. <laughs> All right. Somebody sing the song. I'm not saying you can't sing. But I don't like to see you jump up and lead a song more and more and more. And you're not an expert singer. Now listen, I know singers on the choir now. I can tell you whether you can sing or not. Is that right? I don't care how you feel about me. I don't care. <laughs> All right, let's go. You think you can pull it? You want to pull it? You, you think you can pull it? Think you can sing it and go? You want to try it? All right, let's do a little better. Let's pick it up. All right, go ahead now. Stay in the way. <laughs> Come on. Pastor is getting tired of hearing these 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 bad songs <laughs> from these bad singers, and he's had enough of it. He's he tired of people just jumping up and saying, "You know what? I got it today, Pastor." No, you do not. Sit down, let somebody else sing it, and and if you think you can pull it, then <laughs> come on, jump up here. But if you can't pull it, sit out somewhere. We, we, we'll play a CD. We got plenty of CDs back here. We got vinyls. We got eight tracks. We got all kind of stuff we can play and just enjoy and worship the Lord that way. You ain't got to jump in and sing because cause you ain't got it. Today, you ain't had it last Sunday. You ain't had it 10 years ago. You ain't had it 20 years ago when you joined the choir and you were singing, but you wasn't saved nowhere. You don't got it. So sit out and, and just let somebody else get it. <laughs> At the end of the day, if you know you can't sing, like you just, this ain't your gift. Like I don't care how you sound when you, it's just you in the mirror. I don't care how you sound in the car, in the shower. If this is not your gift, <laughs> let let it go. <laughs> Give it to somebody else. Pastor, that's basically what Pastor was trying to tell her. She didn't want to hear it. She went and tried it anyway because she got faith in herself. <laughs> so, <laughs> so she tried it and it's awful. And pastor can do nothing but laugh. See, sometimes, see, laughter is like medicine. I think that's what the spirit was trying to stir up in the church. They was trying to stir up laughter. So, the, so at the end of the day, if you know you ain't got this gift, let it go. Let somebody that's good at that thing handle that thing.